Hello YouTube, a uh, while back I made a video regarding the LEC jerseys and I basically made a tier list uh, about them. If you haven't seen that video, um, go ahead and check it out, I'll leave it in the description down below. But in today's video, we are going to be taking a look at fake jerseys. So these jerseys have been made by a fan, so they're not original, but they look really, really cool. And some of them actually look better than the original jerseys. So um, first I'm going to be showcasing all of them and then we'll be putting them into a uh, tier list maker and um, I want your guys' opinion on which jersey is the best so let me know in the comment section down below which one do you like the most so let's just jump into it first we have Koi the pro jersey right here then we have uh, I'm assuming this is Rogue's icon so I think this is Rogue um, fake design then we have cloud9 and then we have misfits who are no longer in the LEC unfortunately they split up as an orc from what I remember but here's their fake jersey and then we have five more actually um, here we have G2 Feel free to pause at any time if you want to have a better look at all the jerseys. Here we have Bison's e club This is the only team that I don't know um, personally. So yeah, someone in the comments can maybe uh, let me know who Bison's e club is. Um, then we have Mad Lions. And then we have Fnatic. And then there is one more jersey. I think it's in the comments somewhere. Oh, has the comment been deleted? I can't really find it right now. But it is EG's jersey uh i'll have a picture thrown up on screen right now um do this one right here i'll try and see if i can find the full picture of it but let's start with koi so we have a black yellow purple theme um looks pretty cool i like the fact that the sponsors are evenly spread out i like the um, the sleeves on the jersey. I'm not too big of a fan of the bottom part. Um, it seems kind of like a prototype um, jersey. Uh, I don't mind these like small uh, white rings on the black background uh, jersey on both the front and the back. But I feel like you could have done more at the bottom part. It just seems like unfinished. Like it, it looks cool, but it looks unfinished. Um, so I will put it in B tier for now, but we might change it up. Then we have Rogue. So a lot more color here, a lot more is going on. Um, I like the fact that there's a sponsor here and then here the theme continues um, with all these bright colors. Um, and they even have it in, in white as well. But the black one actually looks better than the white one. So I'll, I'll just uh, rate the, the black one. It's actually a really cool jersey. I actually really, really like it. A lot of colors happening and it, and it looks like a finished jersey. It looks like a, a final design. So I'm going to put this one in A tier. Then we have Cloud9. I like the color theme. Uh, this like bright blue with uh, black and yellow. What I will say is I don't like the fact that the BMW logo is like half in, half outside the dragon. What I would have wanted is either make the dragon smaller. So you would have BMW uh, outside the dragon. Um, Kind of like here with the C9 logo that is like around. Um, or you just move the BMW logo 
down so it's part of the dragon and kind of implement implement it a little bit more um and i also don't like the fact that the red bull logo is higher up than the bmw logo and then there's a puma logo here and two logos here and here it just looks uneven and it doesn't look clean um so i'll put this one in b tier but i'll put it below koi then we have misfits gaming with the red white and black theme with a demon looking character to it i wish we could have a look at the back just to see what the design would look like um personally not the biggest fan of the demon design i don't really like it uh, i'm sure some people will like it personally i don't like it uh too much um the colors look cool there are not really any sponsors from what i can tell um but that's not really needed because there's so much else going on in this jersey but because it's not really a theme that i like i will have to put it in i'll put it on at the bottom of b tier for now and let's move on to the next one so then we have g2 with a golden white and black theme with a dragon i like it we have the emblem with the uh or we have the logo and then with like an effect with all of these stripes with a circle around makes it seem like a shiny sun or something uh, i like it um this is a dragon but it's also human so it's half dragon half human shivana something like that i don't know chinese dragon maybe um the cool thing that i like here is just the design and it seems like simple uh, without actually being plain i really really like it and the way that the sponsors are kind of being put could have been put a little bit better but the front design looks very very cool and we have g2 army here at the bottom um so i will put this one at the top of b tier and then we're gonna downgrade the misfits onto a c tier and then we have Bison's e Um So there is this emblem. Uh, the logo is very, very big. I don't like the fact that it's being put two places because it's right here. And then it's just being made even bigger right here. I feel like there should be something different here. Um, and then it just seems very plain, not too much going on. There are, of course, a little bit of texture in this jersey, but it's just too plain it's not really there there should just be something else going on uh in in my opinion um not not enough is happening in this jersey so this one's also a c tier and it's actually going to be put below the misfits one because the misfits one i just personally don't like the the theme that's going on but there is a very cool um looking theme at least for some people Whereas the Bison's e clop, uh, yeah, nothing crazy is going on. And then we have Mad Lions, also kind of like a golden theme. Um, I like the golden theme once again, um, this time on a white jersey. I like the fact that there are not as many sponsors. Um, I don't really like the fact that there is this same coin or emblem. On the sleeves as well as on the front i would actually have made this one uh i would have made the emblem smaller and probably put mad lions on top of it or maybe around the edge of the circle um rather than at the bottom but i also like this bottom part here this is also really nice the gold end of the sleeves also looks really nice i'm just personally not the biggest fan of three uh of the same logos uh, on the jersey and then i would have made some smaller adjustments but it's a really cool looking jersey but i would have made some changes to it so it will be put in b tier it will be put above the koi jersey and then we have the fanatic jersey so fanatic jersey we have the classic orange themed Jersey, the BMW logo and the Fnatic logo, and then the AMD. Not too many sponsors here. Uh, we have. I don't really like the fact that it says Fnatic here and Fnatic here. 
So that should just been placed once. And then we have these kind of like guardian angel wings here on the sleeves. Or like from chest part to sleeve. Which looks pretty cool, but I don't really see the... I don't really see the... Uh, the transition from these angel looking wings to this which I'm assuming is feathers from a peacock because this looks like a peacock right here um, but I don't really follow uh, these feathers like I don't see how the feathers and then these guardian angel looking wings are supposed to be together um, so therefore I feel like it's two different jerseys that that's kind of the problem so I, I can't really put it uh, up too high, so I will put it at the bottom of B tier. Now we have too many jerseys in B tier. Oh, and then if uh, I can show the EG jersey, then it's really, really, really bad. Uh, so that one is an obvious D tier. So just to mix it up a little bit, uh, Rogue will then be promoted to S tier. The G2 jersey will be A tier. And then we have Mad Lions, Koi, C9, and Fnatic as B tier. And then we have C tier with Misfits and Bison Eclop. And in D tier we have uh, EG's jersey, which basically looks like a Ninja Turtle TFT honeycomb looking jersey, which is not very uh, pleasing to look at in my opinion. So those are all the fake jerseys. Um, shout out to Elia Kiddo, is that the guy who made them? Let me see here. Uh, yeah, Alia Kiddo, the person who made them. A lot of these are actually really, really cool looking. Or uh, with, in my opinion, some of the smaller uh, adjustments that I mentioned, I would find them really, really uh, cool. So let me know which one you guys like the most. Which one would you put in S tier? And um, if you enjoyed the video, remember to leave a like. If this video gets a decent amount of uh, views and likes, then I will make another video where I'm going to be rating all of the LCS jerseys because I haven't done those ones yet. So yeah, otherwise subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. And then I just want to say thank you for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next YouTube video. See you guys.